little fun if you Christmas bonus either. Yeah. Nice little present for you. We could have got another box. We could have got here. Look, 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 look what I've brought you. Oh, oh great, jeez. Yeah, <laughs> I'm pleased about that, yeah. The yeah. lid's not working. All oh, right. And do you know what I did first thing when I come in? Monday. Cool. I walked up to it. And I went, right, let's start chucking the hatches. <laughs> Opened it and ping, I broke it. Told you it broke something. <laughs> <laughs> He always says I've got something for you to do. So you can't... We were a bit unlucky really, because what we did break was then. Mm. You see, see how I'm using your trick now, what we broke. <laughs> and then we will what, fix what it. you broke. It would have been easier if that had broke, the flap. Because they just clip yeah. back on. Yeah. Right? So we broke them bits there. So what we've got to do now... Disconnect it inside. Disconnect it all and put a new one it's down. Not, it's not a bad fit though, is it? It's what we're on there. Mm -hmm. Ah, it's a compression fit in them. Yeah. Did they send a nut and olive with it? Don't be silly. It must be, yes. It must be a nut and olive with it. Not an olive with it. Well, it looks like 10 mil because the nut and olive will be compressed onto it. Well, the olive will be compressed onto it. So? No problem. So? Just put this here, Kev. Give me that. Oh, crack on. <laughs> You're a star, aren't you? Right, we'll have to go inside first and disconnect. Gas off, disconnect, and then we'll whip it off. Okay. Yeah. Right, so uh, this is what we're going to replace now. Uh, what I've had to do inside the van to get access to the rear of that is to remove all this panel there so that panel and the small panel there <coughs> that's the back of the back barbecue point as you can see uh, we've got a small nut there which is to undo then we'll undo it from outside and replace it obviously sealing it to the body Right, so that's the, uh, the barbecue point fitted in there. We're all piped up in there. So what we need to do now, because obviously we've interfered with the gas line, is we need to put a test on the van uh, to check for any leaks. So we've got the gas cylinders here. We've got a test nipple there on the uh, regulator. So what we'll do now is uh, we've got the gauge and we'll put a test on and see how it goes. Right, so we've uh, we put a gas test on, we know we've got no leaks. Uh, what we will do now is a bit of belt and braces turn, we'll do a bit of uh, Leak detector, just to be doubly sure. <coughs> the only connection we've disconnected is this one here. So we just a squirt with the old leak detector. <laughs> and as you can see, it's all good. So we're all fine there. So the next job is to put all the cabinetry back together. 